Hello, everybody. Welcome to the evening prayer. Tonight, I'm talking about depression. Um, I'm not too proud to say that I do suffer the occasional depression and panic attacks and anxiety, and I know I'm not alone. And I've been dealing with these lately. Um, but these times do draw you closer to God. So blessed are the poor in spirit, Jesus said, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. The blessing, the first in a series of blessings from Jesus, Sermon on the Mount, illustrates our Lord's compassion for those who suffer from the darkness of depression. Many in the Bible have wrestled with depression. David wrote several Psalms while in the depths of despair. Moses, Job, Elijah, Hannah, Hagar, and others cried out to God for solace. Jesus himself, we are told, was tested in every way just as we are. As long as this world exists, so will trouble. Take cheer, however, for Jesus have overcome, has overcome the world. And then there's a little devotion, and it's called Praise Through the Tears. Psalms 42, 11, Why are you in despair, my soul? Why are you disturbed within me? Hope in God, for I shall still praise him the saving help of my countenance and my God. Picture it, a group of Christian teens huddled together, praying for one another's pain, one another struggling, one another's failings. The sincerity in their hearts was undeniable. Their desire for God's peace and presence was palpable. And God did not disappoint. His presence was as visible as it could possibly be the sight of heaven. The release the size of the contentment, the warmth of God's joy radiating from the inside out, the healing. These were praises in the midst and aftermath of despair. I was there. I witnessed it. I was part of it. I was blessed and forever changed. A permanent, a permanent reminder to praise God in all things and in all circumstances was engraved upon my heart. The despair you witness and experience may not look anything like another's trials, but that's not important. What is important is that God is always the same. He's always willing and able to deliver us and bring us hope. Reflection, what despair and heartache am I still holding on to? Will I give it over to God today? Holy God, thank you for your presence and for never giving up on me. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I hope if anybody's going through this, that take heart. Um, I've been going this for, through this for a very long time, and I don't know what triggers it. Sometimes I don't, but it's just a roller coaster ride. But the only thing gets me through is God. But also, it's in those times of depression that we call out to God the most. Do you think maybe he's refining us? He has something for us, so we have to go through this refining period, like boot camp, make you stronger. I love you guys. God bless you. Please pray for me, and I'll pray for you. I love you.